Hello, everyone. Welcome to my Wealthy Lifestyle. Hope all is well with y'all today. I don't know where you're watching me from, but I welcome you all to my Wealthy Lifestyle. I ask that you like, share, and subscribe to my channel, pressing the notification bell for future content. I want to give you all a word for some single parent. Ladies, you can't be the father. You can only be the mother. You can't be the father. You can only be the mother. You can't teach your sons how to be men. But you can show them what to look for in a woman. By being the best mother that you can be. Respecting them as you would have them to respect you. Even as parents, we, we must respect our children. It goes both ways. Be the best mother you can be. And when you are the best mother that you can be, God said he'll do the rest. He will do the rest. Focus your time on your children because they didn't ask to come here. Raise them to the best of your ability. And that that you have done will come back and honor you. The life that you have lived in front of your children will come back and honor you. I can remember when my children were young and I was uh, the only um, parent in the household and I felt like I had to, to um, be the mother and the father. But I couldn't be the father. I could only be the mother. And the Lord told me one day I was in tears. The Lord said, just be the best mother that I could be. He said that he will do the rest. So as, as, as a mother, as a single mother, it, the load seems so heavy because we feel that we have to do it alone. But even though the father is not there physically, we have a heavenly father who's there for us. And when we trust and depend on him, he will handle the rest. He will handle the rest. Don't put men before your children. Your children need you. Focus your time and your energy on your children and their well-being because they're going to grow up someday. And they're going to look at you. They're going to either honor you or they're going to disrespect you. How you brought them up, the things that they saw you do in front of them will catch up with you in the long run. We must be respectful women. We must be respectful mothers. All that you done have done for your children growing up will come back and honor you. But you must be honorable. Times get hard. You may even get lonely, but do it in a tasteful way, not in a distasteful way. Don't put a man over your children. Give your children the love and your attention that they deserve. Or else, if you don't, it'll come back and hunt you. It will hunt you. Don't disrespect your children. Respect them. And as you give respect, you will get respect. Some of us think since we are their parents or we are grown and we can do what we want to do. But even as grown, grown ups, we have rules that we have to follow as well. And you're teaching your children that even though they are going to grow up, there's still rules that you have to follow. I was led to give this message, this word. 
and I'm just going to let it go for right now until Lord has something else for me to say. But take this word. Take this word and use this word. Dissect this word and let this word work for you because it worked for me. And what works for me may work for you. Love on your children. If you don't love on them, they're going to look elsewhere for love. Until next time. Thanks for watching.